Well, it might be a good time for Madonna to check her New York post box. The Queen of Pop's been invited back to Russia, though this time not to appear before her adoring fans, but rather before her adoring prosecutors. Artist Lucy Kafanov reports. The material girl herself is unlikely to materialize, but that hasn't stopped a Russian court in Russia's second city of St. Petersburg from agreeing to hear a case, a lawsuit against her for more than $10 million in damages by anti-gay groups who allege they have suffered, quote, moral damages from uh, a performance that she held recently in that city in August. Now, the reason we're talking about the story today is the plaintiffs have confirmed to the media that they have found uh, Madonna's New York City address and have sent a summons there for her to sh show up to the St. Petersburg Court. They've also sent a summons for her to a uh, health fitness club, the Hard Candy Club here in Moscow. And they're basically trying to get her into the courtroom uh, again in order to hear this case, which alleges that uh, Madonna essentially promoted so-called homosexual propaganda during her concert there. She asked people to sort of raise their hands in support and handed out t-shirts and, and, and uh, banners and whatnot. But St. Petersburg, unlike the rest of Russia, uh, had recently passed a law that bans the so-called promotion of of homosexuality, bisexualism, transgenderism. So these groups allege that what Madonna did uh, effectively trampled on that law, violated that law, and uh, supposedly psychologically damaged the uh, the conscious and, and, and the feelings of um, the residents who were exposed to that. Madonna is no stranger to controversy from burning crosses in a music video in the U.S. to exposing a nipple in Istanbul uh, to speaking out, uh, picking a fight with the National Front in Paris by screening a video of their leader with a swastika on her head and of course stirring controversy here in Russia also by speaking out in defense of the punk band group Pussy Riot. Uh, she's no stranger to controversy. The question is whether she'll actually appear uh, in this courtroom and as of now, uh, especially if they don't get the summer translated, it doesn't really seem likely, but we'll of course keep following the story for you.